Hi, my Sagittariuses. I hope you guys are doing awesome. I'm here to give you your next 72 hours. Uh, please keep in mind that all messages are general and take it as it resonates, okay? Let's go ahead, go ahead. And also, even though I say the next 72, this may actually resonate a week later or so. So, who is someone, um, I'm picking up on the thing about someone going, someone going, um, taking a trip to go f perform somewhere. If you're a performer, you'll be taking a trip to go perform somewhere. Um, some of you Sagittarius will be going on a trip to go see a performer. I got, that's for some of you, Sagittarius. We have Halloween and lying here. Interesting. One more. What's going on with Sagittarius in the next 72? <laughs> okay, Sagittarius, that's really truthful. I mean, that's like to the point. So some of you Sagges in the next 72, you're gonna find out. Now this happened around Halloween, that somebody was somebody was lying about something. There's some type of lie that happened around Halloween. I feel like it's this Halloween um, and someone's hiding the truth, like hiding the truth because it says hidden truth right here. You are hiding from your true self. I feel like someone's been hiding the truth, um, but this is about to come out and the truth is about to be revealed here. Let me pull some more cards for your next 72. What else is going on? I feel like this is going to be happening in perfect timing. You need to know this. Yeah, another one. We have needing a mentor right here. I also feel like some of you are going to be looking for a mentor because you need some type of mentor for something. Or you'll be advising your mentor. Well, your mentor will be advising you, I'm sorry. Someone's doing a sleep study. That's, um, that's what's coming out too. Also a need to get organized, Spirit is saying. I feel like you are trying to get much more organized here. Oh, and there's like some workplace drama. Some For some of you, it's some type of lie that happened around Halloween. It, it involves your workplace, um, but not all of you. Yeah. And we've also have some like nightmares and sleep problems in the next 72. A need for you to get some more, like some better sleep here. You might be experiencing some sleep problems. That's, that's crazy because I just said sleep study. I just said sleep study. Okay. I'm sorry. I get excited <laughs> still. All right. Tell me more about what's going on with Sagittarius. Okay, in the next 72, we have the star. I love the star. Some past clarification. And we have the king of wands here. Okay, I want to know about this lie. The... President. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'll explain things in just a minute. Thoughts, feelings, and actions. Clarification. Good. I feel like for some of you, this is someone that you took your guard down with. Like, you let your guard down. Um, for some of you. And you're going to... There's like some type of tower moment I'm getting. That's for another group of you. Um, what you should... Uh, okay. To be aware of, be cautious of the chariot clarification. Um, also, keep cautious of your vehicles in the next 72. Pay attention to your vehicle in the next 72. Um, some of you might need to get some maintenance check. Also, be cautious of the roads I'm getting. Like when you're driving to the work, be cautious. Like, don't be messing with your phone. Really pay attention in the next 72 when you're driving. Okay, Sagittarius. So when I look at your cards right here, I have the you have the star and the king of wands in your energy. So I feel like um, you're coming from this energy of healing, hope, um, a lot of success with what you're doing. 
the king of wands, he gets things done, right? He gets things done. He's very creative, dynamic. Um, he's fearless. I feel like you're very proud. You, you're getting things done. You have a lot of hope. Um, you're coming out of this really positive energy right here. I also see that the positive, positive energy continues in the next 72 because we do have the Page of Wands and the Moon. I feel like you also receive some type of good news. Um, someone might be interested in you um, with working with you with something, or this could be like a relationship, but it doesn't even have to be that. I do see some type of good news after a time of confusion. You've been confused about something and you're getting some type of clarity here. I feel like you are. Um, but I also see, Sag, that in your next 72, there's something about not compromising with someone. With this Queen of Pentacles right here, I feel like for some of you, you're not compromising with um, your comfort. Having to do something with your comfort or your living arrangements, that's for some of you. For another group of you, I'm getting this could be like a female, a mature female. Um, you know, you're not really compromising with them. Or just an earth sign in, just just an earth sign in particular. Sorry, I was drawn to this chair right here. It has something really funny. Some of you might notice something like weird on your chair. I know that sounds <laughs> like random because some of my readings can be readings can be very um, random. But something about something on the couch that you didn't really notice before, very strange. Um, but yeah, I'm getting like this thing with a, a need for some for you to compromise with something, but you're not really wanting to compromise with this person. Um, and what to look out for in the next 72, like I said, is your drive home for work. I feel like it's your drive home from work because the King of Pentacles work um, represents employment to me and the chariot can be a vehicle. So really pay attention this week when it comes to your driving. And... Please stay away from workplace drama. It could be someone at your work or whatever that you're having some type of drama with. Um, yeah, stay away from that. We have family sorrow, unsuccessful plans. And you're on the right path. So I do. So there is going to be some type of family sorrow in the next 72. Something that you're going to be a little bit... Um, sad about I'm getting and I feel like for some of you it's linked to this lying and this um, and it happened around Halloween like it coming out right here and it's kind of making you sad it has something to do with someone in your family for for a lot of you I'm getting um, but I do see something not working out in the next 72 don't get discouraged <laughs> it could be something very simple as I always say this when this card comes out, like you wanting to go eat at Chick-fil-A and then you realize it's closed on Sunday. I mean, like some, something silly. Something may not go as, as planned, but that's okay though. And Spirit is letting you know that you are on the right path regarding some aspect on your life. So you are definitely still on the right path. Okay. Let me go ahead and pull a relationship card for you. Okay. I'm just going to pull one for your relationships, whether it's romantic or platonic. We have commitment here. It says you are attracting a, you are attracting a lifelong commitment, a life partner or soul flame. This is the one you'll choose to spend this life with. There could be an engagement, a sacred union, or a renewal of vows. A current relationship could be propelled forward and you know what's really interesting Sag I feel like for some of you um it's like you and someone else you are reaching another level of deeper commitment here um and spirit is basically saying like if you're single or whatever I do see someone coming in and being interested in you um and wanting some type of commitment from you but it's going to be up to you um spirit is saying for some of you you may not want to compromise with this person all right for your finances, Sag. We have ring right here. So yeah, somebody's coming in with some type of commitment. Um, I'm also getting like with this good news, it's like some type of partnership. Somebody wants to like work with you, some type of partnership when it comes to your finances. There's some type of offer here. And we have mask. Finding money. 
So some of you are going to end up finding some type of money. Um, not literally, well, I mean, you might find some money around the house. <laughs> not literally like finding, stumbling upon it, but finding a new way to generate money uh, that you didn't know about. It's going to help you with your confusion. All right, I'm just going to pull a couple of channeled messages and we will be done. I don't want to pull a lot. Okay. Okay, so we got stop trying to be so politically correct. So when you're speaking in the next 72, make sure you're being the, your authentic self and not trying to, you know, be so like politically correct. Also, I'm getting like, um, I got dizzy here. Some of you might be like something going on with your health and that's probably why you're having some sleep problems. You might be getting dizzy spells. Um, it says stop making up things in your head, Sagittarius. Stop making up things that have not happened yet. Like making up uh, the worst case scenario. Your mind is lying to you, I'm getting. Some of you have an old friend that's about to return. And also, huh, I love this one. It says everything you lost, you're, you're going to get back plus more. So everything you lost... You're going to get back plus more. Some of you may be experiencing some heartburn. I know this this is random. <laughs> and stop complaining so much. Some of you might find yourself trying, like, complaining about something. Spirit is saying stop complaining so much. All right, Sag, if you like this reading, hit the thumbs up. Hit subscribe if you really like it. I love you all and have a wonderful next 72. Bye.